In this lesson, we're going to study how to make a terrain. To make terrain, contour lines are required. Even if scoping hasn't done yet, still you have changed to get the contour line. Download a numerical map from the website ngii.go.kr in Korean, 국토지리정보원. This map contains data about roads, buildings, contours, rivers, or streams, and so on. Enter the address you want and get the numerical map with different scales. The scale with the least value provides the most accurate data. So download the map with this scale, sign up for membership of NGII and you can download the map. The numerical map doesn't contain information of the cadastral map, so download the cadastral map from the website LURIS in Korean, 토지 이용 규제 정보 서비스. Cadastral data from this map is not that accurate, but if the scoping data is not affordable, this data is uh, relatively reliable. You can scope a lot of uh, regulations as well as cadastral data. You need a program for architecture like uh, Rhino or CAD to modify the Excel file. Open the numerical map and orange line would exist, which are the contour lines. And there are a variety of data, so modification is required for lesson to chance of error when it's open on Revit. Enter a block manager, and all the block would be deleted in the DXF file. Not only block, but also text should be deleted too. Selecting them one by one takes a long time, so layers would be help. Select an object and look at property tab. The layer containing the object then will show up. Just delete that layer, and all the details in layer would be deleted either. The layer starts with H seems useless, so delete all of them. Center line of the road are useless too, so find out the layer containing them. Remember how to find out the layer of the object. Select the center line, then property tab will show the layer of the, this object. Delete the layer with same definition. Delete all layers except one containing data with terrain or road or buildings. Find out the location of site of this project by browsing search history. And of course modify the scale of this model. Using the original scale of the file is best, but if you cannot remember, scale can be calculated by measuring the width of the road. The width is the 8mm, so it must be a 8m width load. So magnify the en entire model thousand times bigger. The entire terrain data is too big comparing to context we create. Trim the model regarding the context and terrain boundaries and export this model for format of DWG file. Go back to Rabbit and click Insert, Import CAD, Import the DWG file save in prior. The original point of DWG file and Revit file is not required, 
move this model to coordinate the original point in together. After this work, click Messing and Sites, Tofu Surface in Korean, Ji Hyungmyeon, Create from Imports in Korean, 가져오기 작성. Select layer having terrain data only. In Filter tab on the left side, you can modify material. Just click OK. And terrain is created. Move the terrain about the original model. Then select the terrain and click Messing and Site. Subregion in Korean. 소구역. It is drawing projection of road lines and the surface of the terrain. This takes a long time, so I show this process in the brief. I draw a square and when I click subregion, the projection of it is created on the terrain. So the projection of road lines would split the surface of the terrain.